Hi, my name is Stephanie and I'm from Calibrate Studio. Today I'm going to be taking you guys through a few mobility exercises for rehab prevention and management. And the first thing I want you to do is squeeze your shoulder blades and lift your elbows up as high as they can go. Once you are there, I want you to slowly start to swim your hands overhead. Once you're there, you hold for a second before you slowly come back out the exact same way that you came in. Swimming your hands bit by bit, rotating the shoulders inwards, and you're gonna finish off with your hands back onto your lower back and then relaxing your elbows to the floor. You wanna make sure your hips, your shoulders, and your lower back are flat on the wall. From there, we bring our elbows up into a 90 degree angle with the wall. I want you to bring your right elbow up towards the wall. Your left hand goes downwards to try and touch the wall as well. We're gonna repeat for another three times. So make sure you're doing three on each side, rotate through. Really think of the movement coming from inside the shoulder joint as opposed to your wrists controlling the movement. I want you to keep your back nice and upright and you're gonna squat all the way down and then we're gonna introduce the rotation. So you're gonna try and reach your right arm up all the way towards the sky. Then you bring that arm down and then rotate onto the other side as well. So set up your feet nice and wide, then you bring your right knee to the inside slowly, trying to ground both knees to the floor, lifting up your right knee now. So you're going to bring that right knee up, we're going to come back into that bear sit, good. Once you found your bear sit, we do the same thing on the other side, and then again we come back into our bear sit nice and slow, and then you repeat three times on each side. From there, your toes are gonna to point forwards towards the front side of the room. Squat down to one side. So you're coming down to a single leg lunge, straight leg, you're gonna point your toes up towards the sky and try to sit that hip down to the floor. And then you're gonna slowly transition over to the other side, staying as low as you can. You come straight into the opposite leg, and again. I want you to lift your knees off slightly Push through your toes and lift your bum up to make the shape of an upside down V. The first part of this, we're going to try and push our heels down to the floor as much as possible. Lift our right heel towards our right bum, so we're standing on one leg right now. And now we're going to bend that left knee. From there, we're going to change sides, straighten out the legs, grounding your right heel as you bend your right knee, and then bringing your heels back down and repeating again. 